So one topic that doesn't seem to get talked about a whole lot when doing research for boxing, you're always looking at brands of gloves, types of gloves, boxing gyms, workouts, different exercises you can do, all that stuff. So how do you wash your boxing gloves? How do you keep them clean? I'm sure growing up, we all remember coming in from school and there was that heap of uh, sporting goods over in the corner of the garage that just absolutely reeked. You got a whiff and it wasn't good. So the same thing can happen to your gloves. You're sweating. If it stays in there, you get bacteria. It's not good stuff. But first and foremost, I want to mention, do not put your gloves in the washing machine. When I was researching all these different topics uh, for, for the blog and for this uh, YouTube channel, I don't know how many times people got on there like, can I just throw them in the washer? Seems like it would make sense. They're just a material like any other glove. But no, do not put them in the washing machine. I'm sure people have life hacks on how you can do it and make it work, but unless you want that funny, this is how I destroyed my boxing glove story, don't do it. The only person that's going to benefit from that is the person that makes your gloves when you go in to buy a new pair. So keeping them clean, really easy. First thing you want to do is go get an antibacterial spray. Uh, Vapor Fresh is a brand I see mentioned a lot. It's the brand I use. Uh, and after your workout, spray the outside and the inside, especially the inside of your gloves, and then let them dry completely. Do that after every workout and let them dry completely after every workout. Um, if you live somewhere that's hot and humid, don't leave them in your car. Uh, they're just going to potentially sweat or fester or all kinds of nasty stuff. And actually, for that matter, don't leave them in your car if you live in a cold area. I grew up in Alaska and it gets really cold really fast in the winter time. And uh, if there's moisture inside, moisture freezes, it can damage the leather or the composite material. So if you can all help it at all, just don't leave them in the car. That goes for any workout equipment. And then your car also will end up stinking and that's no good. Um, wear hand wraps. Uh, that's just good practice in general, but for the sanitation concept uh wear hand wraps because most of the sweat is just going to absorb right into those they're a lot easier to clean than boxing gloves since you can stretch them out or hang them over uh, a doorknob to let them dry spray them with the antibacterial spray also spray the inside of the gloves even if you use hand wraps because you're going to get some sweat that's going to bleed through i'm sure hand wraps a lot of times they might actually be machine washable i actually haven't looked that would have been something good to look up um but even if you try it and you destroy them, an 8 to $10 pair of hand wraps is a lot easier and cheaper to replace than a $40, $50, $60 plus dollar pair of boxing gloves. Uh, check with the company that makes your gloves. Uh, some of the older leather style wants you to oil them, the, the outside of them, to keep them from cracking, keep them soft. Uh, I think that most of the new composite material gloves uh, don't have that requirement, but... Check with the brand that makes yours because uh, things might change depending on who makes them and uh, what material they're made out of. And lastly, if you picked up a pair of used gloves or you have some hand-me-downs, they might already have that kind of funky smell in them. Uh, you can pick up little bag deodorizers to put inside of them after your workout. Again, spray them with anti-back spray, let them dry completely, um, but you can pick up those uh, deodorizers. Put them inside that'll help get rid of some of the smell you can get scented and unscented ones uh, so whatever you prefer there so the bottom line is if you use antibacterial spray and let your gloves dry completely that's going to get you a long way they're, they're your gloves are going to last for years if not decades if uh, just take good care of them so hopefully you found this helpful and we'll see you on the next one